Hello guys, welcome back. Today I'm gonna show you how to make these cover fa Facebook pages, um, profiles. Like you can see the cover image, it matches with a profile picture. So just like this one. It's gonna be two in one or one in two. So let's begin. So this is gonna be the template we're gonna be using and the image I'm gonna use is gonna be the same one you saw on my page so I'm going to get that image right now and it's going to be this one you know what I'm gonna use the other one this one right here I'm gonna click OK and before I start doing anything, I'm just going, going to rasterize this layer by right-clicking it and re rasterize layer. So next, I'm going to lower the resolution because this image is too big. So I'm just going to type 72 on resolution and on width, I'm going to put 1200. and I'm going to move this layer so this layer is called cyber cyber girl I'm going to be referring to this layer as a woman so I'm just gonna move the woman layer below the white part or white area layer right there so next I'm going to press ctrl T to transform this layer and make it bigger I'm just going to click this icon right here to maintain the aspect ratio you can do it by clicking it here or just press shift key and dragging one of the corners so I'm just going to move this to one side and I'm going to make it bigger and you can use any image you want but for this tutorial you can use this one to get an idea how to do it I'm going to put the template in this image on the description for you to download it um, you can just give me credit for the image and that's it or you can use your own image that doesn't matter so once you have the image the way you want it click OK and as you can see we have this empty space on the right side so I'm going to fill that out with the same background as the woman so I'm going to get um, a rectangular marquee tool I'm going to select this area uh, I'm going to um, deselect that so I have the rectangular market to select it and I'm going to put zero on feather so next I'm going to select that again and once selected I'm going to press ctrl T to transform and I'm just going to get the middle point and expand that to the right like that and click OK Control D to deselect and like you can see we have the background all the way to the right and um, here is like an empty space you can put anything you want but this is just a tutorial so I'm just gonna leave it like that so next we're done with this the next thing is to save the images for the cover and the profile picture so what I'm gonna do next is get the crop tool and I'm going to zoom the image and I'm going to move the crop to the lower part of the crops area and I'm, go I'm going to move it just till here I'm gonna press enter or ok and I'm going to deselect the white area the white part layer 
so I click on the eye icon to deselect that and I'm just going to save this by going to file save for web and save and you can name it anything you like I have it right here I'm just gonna replace that so I'm going to click save replaced and that's it so next I'm, I'm going to press Control alt and Z to go back and I'm gonna get the crop tool again and I'm going to do the same thing bad with the profile picture square I'm just gonna move all the crap thing to this little square and I'm going to make sure to put the area of the crap tool inside the white lines just like that and click OK so now go to file save for web and save you can name it anything you you want I'm just gonna replace it save replace and that's it so I'm going to go to my page on Facebook and I'm gonna move the mouse inside the cover image and click change cover then just click on upload photo and select the image you just saved and click OK click on save changes and next go to the profile picture and click on edit profile picture and upload a photo and just select the one you, uh, we just did click OK open and you're gonna see something like this the profile picture is gonna be bigger than the rest of the body and to fix that just click on edit pic uh, edit edit profile picture edit thumbnail and click on a scale to fit click save and like you can see now it looks good now it looks like it's only one image so that's how you make your cover image for Facebook I hope you find this helpful and if you like this don't forget to like it comment subscribe and share if you want see you next time and bye bye